Good afternoon, Internet Land. It is Ryan here from Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change and rig ready rams. Today, I'm holding a screwdriver because I just put a dealer plate on this 2019 Ram 1500 Bighorn. We're going to go for a drive. I don't even know if I'm allowed to drive it, but it landed here. The boss is away, and well, I had a plate. But before I potentially get fired, we are going to have a few, you know, roundabouts of the new look. Sorry if I screwed that up a little bit. Anyways, these are the new headlights. They look way better in person. I know you guys seen the pictures and, you know, don't really like it. Way better in person. Front sensors kind of like snuck in there. Your big RAM badging that's like literally engraved into here. It looks nice. But the most important part, still 5.7 liter V8 Hemi. You're going to have 400 horsepower. These things move. They are much lighter than the 2018s. They tow more than the 2018s. So pretty well, it's a lot better than an 18. <laughs> All right, on the interior of this 2019, by the way, this thing feels like it has way more power than an 18, even though they are very similar. I think that's the weight reduction there. But you're going to have your eight-speed transmission dial shift there. You're going to have your four by four buttons. You're still going to have your Bluetooth buttons up here. But I will mention one thing, this steering wheel feels way better. Actually, everything kind of gets in your face a little bit better than the older ones. You're gonna have your auxiliary switches here, so that's kind of a cool new thing. I mean, I'm not plugging anything, but you know, I've seen these in Ford before, so that's one thing I, I liked about Ford, so I'm glad Ram has it now. But you push the button, she's off. Push the button, it's on. You know, do what you gotta do. You feel like a trucker. Now for the tech guys, there is gonna be some USB plugins there, but there's also USB 3 plugins. I have a Google phone, so I have issues trying to find somewhere to plug my USB 3 in. Thank God Ram finally did it. You are going to have your push button, of course. Heated seats, heated steering wheel buttons there. You also got all your functionalities in there. By the way, this 8.4 inch touchscreen is an actual touchscreen. So if you're driving a 13, 14, possibly a 15 where you actually have to push the screen, no more. Literally, the electricity or whatever the science behind it, you just touch it, good to go. All right, guys, so we're going 104 kilometers an hour right now. Yeah, four kilometers over the speed limit. But take a look right there, guys. Actual fuel economy. We're not lying to you. We're not under perfect conditions. We're in Alberta going up and down hills. Wind's hitting us, but we're getting 12 liters per 100. And literally, I don't know if you can tell, but the wind is coming like this right now. So you'll probably realistically get about 11 liters per 100, guys. We're not going to lie to you and tell you you're going to get 35 miles per gallon because you won't, but you will for sure be well in the 20s. Alrighty, so we almost cut the inside video here, but we're not yet because I found a couple more features. Look down here. Here are your cup holders, your money, dividers, whatever you call it. But you can actually push it back and get a bunch of room. Look at that. Put your phone here. Distracted driving. Don't use it, but charge it there, you know? Don't ever distract a drive. Also, power pedals on this big horn. So if you're short, you're tall, whatever it is, you're going to fit. Crew cab, but way more room than the 18s. It definitely feels like it, guys. You got your child divider right here. Kids don't get along. Who cares? They're not gonna touch each other anymore. There is a little compartment here, so if you know you wanna hide something there or your kids wanna put something there, whatever you wanna do, it'll work. Look at all the room on the floor here, guys. I don't know if you like sleeping in the back or whatever you like doing in the back seat, but you can literally put a little cushion here, a little cushion here, kinda like a bunk bed, right? Also storage on the floor on the back you are going to have your bumper of course which they cut down a little bit so that looks sleek you are gonna have your dual exhaust still there are sensors in the back 4x4 backup camera now this is probably one of the cooler things that Ram released but you literally push a button let it go no more slamming down no more breaking stuff whatever you know if you break stuff doing that either way I don't know if you guys can tell but this thing weighs like two pounds. Like, I don't know how to show you I don't have to use effort, but like, I don't know. It's, it's light. We'll just put it that way. All right, guys, if you're interested in this 2019 Ram 1500 Bighorn with a 5.7 liter Hemi, give me a shout at 780-942-3629 or shoot me an email at ryan at redwaterdodge.com. Either way, guys, come in look at it in person I know everyone says it but these 19s genuinely look a hell of a lot nicer in person